Hey everybody, Ann here, way past coffee. I'm out here in the front yard. And I don't know, I think today maybe I need to clean up this yard and open it up for good boy Papa. Well, I got it taken apart and kind of cleaned out. I still got a few posts that I got to remove that I can pull out and put somewhere else. One, two, three, four. Um, the fencing that went here, I just bent it over there. It's not even totally secured right now. Just kind of bent over. The pallets that were on the floor are up against the fence. Uh, I got to find something to do with this here thing. Remember that? <laughs> that I built for that poor lame barred rock rooster? Ah, uh, yeah, and I just uncovered that completely. I think I might just save that and use it for a, you know, if I hatch out some more baby chicks, they can come out here and play around for the day. Um, this is the only weak spot in the fence that doesn't have any wire fencing over it. So, um, I've got this right here. I may be able to put it there. Got some extra chicken wire. Um, but it gives me some more room back here. And what I like is it gets a whole lot of sun back in here. So not only will Papa be able to play back in here a little bit more, that's right. That's right, Papa. Yep, you get more room to run around. Um, I might be able to grow some things. I don't know. I don't know. I've got plenty of garden beds, but um, I'm going to see if I can get these posts out. Oh, look at those pretty chickens just chilling out in the sunshine, kind of trying to get some dust bathing in yeah i gotta give them a dust bath out here i've been saving wood ash in a big bin they're just relaxing it's like springtime out here today i got that one partially out but i i just don't think i have the energy for it today i tried this one got a little bit out but uh i'm gonna have to wait on the on another day when i've got more energy but uh, i'm kind of digging have some having some more room back here this is going to be pretty awesome. And this year, I want to work on the aesthetics of this yard, this front yard, because right now it's looking pretty junky. Another thing I got to do today is this came out of that little um, wire chicken coop thing, and I had kind of fashioned a little perch. They worked really well. Um, well, I don't have it in there anymore. I don't think I'm going to need it. But the leghorn pen needs some new roosts. So I'm going to cut off these parts to make it just a little bit shorter and put it on in there. And I'll show you what I'm talking about in a minute. See that right there? They keep falling down even though I had them screwed in. It strips the screw. Uh, so let me get over here. I had put one already in here. And I just took that other thing out. So I'm going to take that out and see if I cut this board that I got here the right size all right I got it in there it doesn't fit quite as tight as the other one did I just cut it a fraction of the inch of an inch uh shorter but we'll see if this will work all right I'm done doing projects for the day but the next project is to get this chicken run looking better I need to move that tarp um take the blue tarp out because I want no blue tarpage at all and then string the um, deer netting over the top, just straight over the top, just not high and low in here. This is all just pieces, uh, remnants that I had. That's all I had to work with. But I got plenty of deer netting now. So, yeah, just take that over there more off to the side. They don't need all of this shade, especially during the winter. Um, take the blue tarps off take that little drape off because there's no chickens over there. I don't have to worry about them fighting with one another. Um, and then just get this looking a little bit better, you know, but not today. Well, the day's winding down and I got two deliveries, so I'm going to share with you what they are. Okay, first one. This is from Francie. She told me she was going to send me something, but I totally forgot. And she says, it's totally not a present, um, a Christmas present, but I kind of think it is because the card indicates that it is. She sent me a wonderful card and look at this. Okay. 
She crochets and she makes the coolest things ever. Look at this. It's a little a little squishy thing and it's a mushroom. Look at that. I don't know what kind that is. It looks like a flag Eric, but it's blue, so I'll have to research what kind of mushroom that is. It's so cute. And okay, she sent me <laughs> This beautiful holder thingy. And she made some scrunchies. More, more scrunchies for me. Oh my gosh. I have been needing some scrunchies. I have used the ones that she sent me to death. She sent me one of these. And it is going to work really great. I can tell because it feels like it's going to be really good. And then one of these. Kind of similar to the kind that she sent me before. Um... And so she wants me to tell her which one works better. But they both go in this little thing that's going to go up on my little kitchen sink. Look at that. Is that not adorable? Oh, my gosh. That is so cute. Okay. And then she sent me a pretty dish towel. Rise and shine. With a pretty, I think that's a rooster. Yeah, yep, that's a rooster. It's got pointy saddle feathers. Oh, look at that pretty, pretty rooster. Oh, that is so cool. And <laughs> look at this big bag. It says, can you see it? My roost, my rules. He's got a big old leghorn chicken on it. I think that's a rooster though. That is so cool. I wish I could hang this up somewhere as a decoration. So that is so awesome. Thank you so much, Francie. You are so thoughtful. This brightened my day. Oh, oh, there's one more thing I forgot to show you. Uh, it was wrapped in the thing in, in uh, Francie's gift. Look at this. Look at that. It is a little, it's a chicken. It opens up and you can put little trinkets in it. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Look at how pretty it is. It's got little gold trim on it. That is the cutest thing ever. You are so thoughtful, Francie. Thank you. I'm going to put this up on my shelf so it doesn't get knocked over and broken. There we go. I think that's perfect. Okay, this next one, I opened it up. Um, I went into town today and there was something in the wagon at the end of the drive. And um, let me read you the note first. It's got a note in it. It's so cute. Here it is. It says, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year from Christina, Judy, and Judy's cat. <laughs> Bros, uh, Kitty, and Calvin, from Christina and Judy. Oh, thank you, Christina and Judy. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Okay, I'm gonna show you what these are. First of all, uh, another movie. Look at this. This is Mr. Holland's Opus and the Horse Whisperer. Very, very cool. Oh, and those other two videos, uh, DVDs that were sent to me before that I didn't know who they were from. They were for Miss Donna B. So I've got another one to watch. And The Holiday. And it's got Jack Black in it. And I love Jack Black. And Cameron Diaz. And Kate Winslet. I love Kate Winslet too. So uh, I'm going to watch this. I, I've never even heard of these movies before. Well, I've heard of I've heard of Mr. Holland's Opus. And I've heard of The Horse Whisperer. So those are going to be awesome to watch. And check this out. I am obsessed with these things now since Mary sent them to me for the first time. Two big bag bags of these antioxidant uh, snack packs. They've got nuts, raisins, blueberries, all kinds of delicious stuff. Not one bag, but two. Oh, that is so cool. Um, I love those. And I'm out of them, so thank you very much, Christina and Judy and Judy's cat and everybody else that's in that household. I really appreciate it. Bright my day, so 
Thank you. Thank you very much. Well, the day is winding down. Finally, it's about time to do the last chicken chores for the evening. And then I get to relax. So that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.